What's going on, everybody? We finally did it. We have Mutt Master Ryan Shazier, and we're going to be going over some things right now on how I did it and why a lot of you guys have already done it before me uh, coming in from Madden 18. Now, pretty much, you're going to need some grinding hours, bro. The one thing that really made me want to rip my hair out was the 80,000 passing yards. Everything else that happened within it was fine. I didn't have much issue getting everything else done, just playing regular head-to-head -head games. Uh, pretty much, some of you guys are going to be asking about why is it 31 out of 32, but I'm still going to be able to complete Mutt Master? What happens is you can either do the 500 solos or you can win 125 games, I believe. So you see that 95 overall token? You can either win the 500 unique solos or you can do this version. When you do both, you get an additional 500,000 coins. Okay? So pretty much when you do, you're going to have to probably play those games and win those games to get yourself a half a million coins. All right? But you can either do the solos or you can do the 125. It gives you the same 95 overall, um, you know, token. Okay, so now we're going to actually go to the Ryan Shazia card and we're going to upgrade him. And I'm going to be so happy to get my life back. We're going to go over to the actual card uh, in your item binder because I've been upgrading him steadily because I'm also doing his Mutt Master objectives. I don't know if you guys have been doing that as well, but there's a separate Mutt Master objective for him that's in that same list. Let me just show you guys that real quickly before we go back to that. That way you guys understand exactly what's going on. Right next to Mutt Master, there's the Mutt Master stats. Okay, now these have to be done with, with Ryan Shazier. It can be any overall of Ryan Shazier. Uh, so make sure you do this to get an additional 250,000 coins. It seems like it's a lot of stuff, but honestly, once I started putting him in the game, it kind of, it works itself out. Like he just, you know, he gets tackles for loss. It just happens. When I focus on it, I'm probably going to be able to do it relatively quickly because I'm probably going to user him and um, stop usering bar for a little bit against the computer and get it done like that. But when I play online, more than likely I'll blitz him every play because he's a sick card. But just keep in mind that there's a chance for you to get 750K just through doing these things. All right. Now we're going to go over to um, the actual card and we're going to get this guy upgraded, bro. And my life, I'm going to get my life back, bro. Because this dude right here, I don't, know why, I don't know why they're having like issues downloading it or whatever it's doing. Why is it, why is it downloading right there? They better put the card on the right side, bro. Why is it showing it like that? Is it going to show him like this? Bro, what is, what is EA Sports doing? Okay, there he goes. Okay, so pretty much right now, we got him up to a level 20. Are all of them downloaded like that? I don't know. Yo, EA just does whatever they want with their servers. Let me just make sure. Okay, so the 90 won't show, but that 90 shows, that 90 shows, that 92 shows. That happens sometimes, but whatever. Okay, so we're going to go right here. We got to add the chemistry ability slot. Okay, everything seems to be just doing whatever it wants. Why do I have two of them? Probably because um, it's probably because I did the solos enough for that part. Um, so we're going to have two of some of the same things. Again, when you win the additional uh, online games, you're going to get 500K also. So you just continue to go there. You should have everything that you need to upgrade him up to a, a 95 overall. And you can see as he's changing right there, he's getting more and more lethal with each upgrade. Some of the things are not loaded, but it doesn't matter. And this is the final one, okay? The 95 overall Mutt Master token. And this is from 500 solos, not the other part with the online games. But once I'm done with the online games, I will let you guys know what I'm doing with that 500K because it's going to be on and popping. All right, so let's go ahead and add that 95 overall. All right, and there he goes. We have our Mutt Master. These are his stats. Uh, that 90 speed and 91 Excel is just outrageous in the game right now. Um, I'm going to tell you that, listen, this dude, even when I had him at that 89 overall, he was screaming off the edge. So I, I have no idea what he's going to be doing now with the 90 speed, but I just can't wait to see it happen, especially with those loop blitzes. He's just going to be a complete nightmare. All right. So pr this is what the situation is now. I can actually start him. What I need to do, hold on, wait a minute, because all of his chemistry stuff now, it's going to be, it's going to be, uh, I can actually do times two. Oh, times three. Oh, Oh, okay. All right, let me let me let me refund this. Do you want to remove it for 50 coins? Yes, give me my coins. All right, so we're going to do this and we're going to do lockdown times 3 now. Because that's what I'm looking to do for my um my linebackers and um my corners and my safeties. I'm using lockdown. I ha how is he Yo, times 3 though? Yo, that's glitchy. So we'll do that for 75 training, but I had to get some coins back first. All right, so he's locked down times 3. I'm What is this? He got more stuff here. What's this stuff? He got a shaker, leaker, what leaper? What's this brawler? We already knew about acrobat. It just these are more things. What is a shaker? Boost all shaker players. I don't know what this thing. Acceleration, acceleration, leaper, jump. Yeah, I don't really care about all that kind of crap. I'm not doing that. 
I'm gonna pro like I said, my goal is to try to make everybody a sprinter and try to see if we could do something with that, but I'm not trying to spend, you know what I'm saying, all those training points like that for the sprinter. Um, I may end up going, why is it, what is this? Um, you get plus one speed for 20 players. Why is that brawler, that's a, oh, that's times two brawler. That's why. Yo, wow. Okay, so I guess with the 95 overall, you get a little bit more things. But right now, we're just going to keep them with that lockdown. Um, as far as the um, ability, the jump, the snap, I don't need. Hot hands, I don't need. Tip drill, I don't need. Secure tackler, maybe. Under pressure. With for, oh, this, this, might, this might be good. Because if he's close to the QB and under pressure actually works, it's going to cause a lot of issues. The footsteps, I don't care about. Because I'm going to be blitzing him a lot. So if I keep if I give him the under pressure cam, I think that that might be the best case for him. Okay, increases the chance of impact and throw accuracy when putting quarterback under pressure. So because he's usually being blitzed, this might be something that we want. 800, okay. So that's probably what we might do with him. All right, so now that we, we see all that, we know what we're supposed to do. I gave you guys some of the tutorials about how to, you know, get some of those yards easy and stuff like that and to uh, make sure that you know that it is going to be a grind. Okay, but what I'm noticing is a lot of you new guys, you guys don't want to grind for anything. Well, tip it's typical. Nobody wants to do anything. You guys just want stuff, and um, it's not going to happen that way for Mutt Master. And it is, I will give you this, you can do it so much easier than last year, but it's still not easy. All right, because some people are saying, yeah, bro, it's mad, you know what I'm saying, it's mad easy. It's not easy. All those yards and stuff like that early on like that is definitely not easy, but you can get it done. You know what I'm saying? But you got to really put your mind to it. That grind is crazy. And I had to do a lot of repeating solos and stuff like that, which I did share with you with some videos so you guys can understand what's going on with it. Um, the whole objective right now is this, though, because I don't plan on doing anything with Brian Erlocker. I'm going to remove his chem and probably quick sell him for training points. The only issue is I don't know who I'm going to have as my second middle linebacker. You know what I'm saying? Because Zach, this guy this guy, Zach Cunningham, you know, whatever. And then Shaquem Griffin, he was my original blitzer off the edge. But obviously now that I'm going to be using Ryan Shazier, I don't need Shaquem Griffin because he was screaming with just the 84 speed with the blitzes that I run out of 4-3. So if you guys are just, you know, if you guys are not mutt masters, this guy is really, really good right off the edge. You guys have seen videos where he's had like 10 sacks in a game. Uh, Twitch.tv forward slash GMyersWorld. You could, you know, go ahead and check that out. But again, he was a definite goonie. Now with the 90 speed Shazier, God, yeah, I, I have no idea, man. But I'm going to have to get you guys some gameplay with him soon. Um, of course, right now he's not loading again. I, I have no idea what EA is doing. But this is the rest of the team. Bruce Smith, 91 overall. He's not loading. Uh, Joey Bosa, who's a goonie, he's not loading. Uh, Sean Taylor, the best free safety in the game, is not loading. But the whole objective is right now, you see us with the lockdown. I gave him the times three, right? Now, I thought I had 10 before. Did I get rid of somebody else? Because he got three. Okay, yeah, yeah, it's fine, it's fine. Because I got rid of one, but then I added two more. Okay, so it's times three now. All right, so the lockdown, I'm going to be looking to add more zone and more man coverage. Because this year, the man coverage is just as useful as the zone coverage. Okay, so you may notice that dudes are coming out running straight man, and they don't care about life. And they're doing whatever they want to do to you. That's not a coincidence. EA has enhanced the man coverage. So pretty much if you get somebody with really, really good man coverage, you can, you know, get, get away with playing out routes, C routes, slants, and all kinds of other things with that man-to-man -man coverage. Now, the out, the um, when you go to the tight formations, though, that's the one time where man coverage is very, very difficult because they won't stay with the players after a certain step if your player has good beat press and stuff. But for the man coverage in general, they play a lot better. So for a lot of you guys, you guys wonder why I got Ladder Daddy out there. He's only an 87, but he does a lot for me, okay? His man coverage is an 88, which I believe is the meta at least. Uh, I think they're going back with the mid... Uh, you know, the 88 meta stuff. So Jair Alexander and uh, Marshawn Lattimore, that's decent man coverage. So if I switch and give, you know, give my opponent the same look, they're going to play, you know, pretty much the same way. In addition, if I play cover two now with Ryan Shazier, you know, like the end thing is leaving, uh, you know, when you play cover two, leave somebody in the deep blue. You're not, out, you're not going to outrun him. With um, this guy, Brian Erlocker, what is he, like a 78 speed? I don't know. This guy's garbage, bro. Uh, 77 speed. He was getting burnt deep if I would ever run that cover two sometimes. So there's a lot of different things that I'm going to be able to do with, um, you know, the Ryan Shazier card. And it should be very, very exciting what happens with, you know, when it comes to the opponents. Um, offensively, we're still looking the same right now. I'm going to probably get the other seven to max Michael Vick out. Probably within the next couple of days because I'm trying to figure out which way I want to go with the team. What I do know is that I'm going to be keeping um, the, 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 uh, the whole Dallas O-line. I'm going to be keeping these guys. 
You know what I'm saying? I just don't know where, you know, where else I'm going with it, how I'm going to do it, stuff like that. So I just want to make sure you guys are aware of that. Uh, if you do have those three linemen like these guys, keep them. Because regardless of what goes on, they, it, it, listen, they work out. They, they really go out. They really play hard. Uh, they, they're very, very good. And if you have decent linemen in this game, you'll have a lot more success with everything that you're doing, including running the ball, you know, et cetera, et cetera. So just be very, very aware of that when it comes down to the O-line. Now, what am I going to do next now that Muttmaster is done? Pretty much let me go ahead and show you guys what you should be doing. And this is for specific guys that are grinding and understanding that there are a lot of things in this game that are just outright given to you from EA. You just got to put in the time. Everything appears to be downloading, um, but it is what it is. So at this point for me, I don't think I'm going to be doing any Chronicles of Longshot. I'm just not interested in Longshot this year. I just don't really care about what's going on. I'm going to fin finish up these Gatorade challenges. I'm going to see what I can get from these, okay, just to increase the amount of solos that I have because you have different various amounts of coins that you get just from completing solos and if you complete a lot of them you're going to get a lot of coins i think the next thing that i have to do is like 1500 and then you're going to go ahead and get like whatever amount of coins um the training camp as they release it weekly make sure you do that for free training points um the mutt levels i'm going to see what they give i think i unlocked it at 46 yeah so this is going to be completely done once i get that and then i'll look at those um uniforms and see exactly what's going on with it but right now I'm still rocking those Madden Elites, 11, 40, uh, level 40. That's the, uh, my mutt level right now is a 47. But when you get to level 40, you get the option of getting the uh, Madden Elites, um, their jerseys. I would definitely go for that, uh, to, you know, just to make sure that you're looking fly on the field. Uh, it's definitely a nice jersey, both home and away. And that's pretty much what it is. But these are what, this is what I'm talking about as far as the solos go. Uh, is this it? Yeah, okay, this is it right here. So you keep winning the solos, and then you keep getting, you know, additional coins or whatever. And then if you... You know, complete everything, you get 250k. So they give you a lot of different ways to do it. It is a lot of solos, but now that Mutt Master is done, I don't need to keep grinding it. You understand what I'm saying? Like, I don't need to keep, like, having to play the solo so I can do it at my, you know, on my own time. But before, I, you know, every year that the game comes out, we're all in a rush. Well, most of it, and most of you guys are going to be probably doing the same thing. And most of you guys, like I said, are already Mutt Masters. Last year, for 18, we had 400, uh, 400 Mutt Masters. This year, like I said, I won 1,000. So if you are having issues getting through some of the things that you need to do to get Mutt Master, definitely check out some of the videos that are available here. Um, I think I put everything in the playlist for Mutt Master Shazier so that you guys can kind of understand exactly what's going on with it. And it's, you know, it's like I said, the 80,000 um, 80, passing yards, that's the only issue that I had. Everything else, you could just go back to, you know, other solos. Like if you're doing passing TDs, you could just go with the one yard out passing TD and gauntlet repeat it, whatever. But this right here is a lot of work, man. It's a lot of work. So I'm a mutt master. I want to know about you guys. Are you, you know, what's the whole plan? Are you guys planning on being mutt masters? Leave it in the comment section. Um, do you want mutt master gameplay? Do you want to see him go out there and just rip somebody's helmet off and do whatever he wants? I'm going to need you to leave that information in the comments for me. And I'm going to thank you guys for watching. Welcome everybody that's coming in. That's new. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. One love.